Hey everybody, welcome now to the beautiful Dundonald Lynx and today we are playing the most brutal game in golf. However, if you can get through nine holes of this game, you are well on your way to becoming a scratch golfer. And I'm joined today in this match by fellow PJ professional and back in the country, Mr. Andy Carter. If you've not checked out Andy before, he's got a YouTube channel as well. Get down to the description or click here and go check it out. He does some excellent average stuff. to good stuff. <laughs> It's not very nice. <laughs> now the game we are playing, it is absolutely brutal, but also brilliant. So here are the rules. You tee off whatever club you want. It's all about course management, strategy, figuring out how to play. If you miss the fairway, you lose the club that you hit off the tee. Okay. So if you hit driver off here, it lands in the rough, you lose that for the rest of the round. Gotcha. If you miss the green, you lose that club as well. Gotcha. Is there any way of getting the club back? Absolutely not. Fantastic. Once it's gone, it's, it's gone. gone. <laughs> <laughs> and we're going to be playing a stroke play match. So straight up, whoever has the lowest score wins. But here's another catch. If you get down to six clubs, so you lose more than half of your 14 club set, you are out, eliminated. Therefore, the match is over because there's only two of us. Exactly. So <laughs> it's a matter of survival and it's a matter of scoring, and it's a matter of strategy. So you've got to be aggressive, but not too tentative, because tentative equals bad, generally equals bad shots. Absolutely. So you've got to be committed. Yeah, so it's a game of strategy, it's a game of nerves, it's a game of everything. This is such a brutal game, but it's brilliant if you don't want to improve at golf. Guys, also get down to those comments, let us know who you think is going to win, and how many clubs you think we are going to lose. Zero. I'm going fairway green, one put birdie. Okay. Psychology. Love it. So we're playing the back nine at Dundonald. It's pretty early in the morning. We're playing off the white. Now that is a 6,200 yard course. So it's actually going to help us with strategy. So we don't have okay. to hit driver all the time. And that's the okay. point of this. Okay. So what are we I going like with it. first? First off, I've got three iron. First shot of the day. I don't want to lose my three wood. I feel like my three wood's going to get me through this, but I need a bit of a warm up before I get into it. Plus yep. the length of this hole, Three wood driver brings in what I've seen is green fairway bunkers and a bit of rough and it's a bit of a dog leg. So yeah. this is the club, I think, isn't it? Yeah, I think I've so. not actually never played this hole before, which is bizarre because I've been here about six times. I mean, with the three, you're probably gonna have to favor the left half. Well, this is the only issue, you know, classic YouTube preparation. There has been no warm up. So three <laughs> iron have, off the back. We did have a full English breakfast though. <laughs> yeah, and it did. was sensational. Well, full Scottish actually. Sorry, but, full Scottish breakfast. Yeah. Respect your surroundings, Andrew. Sorry. Okay. Did the one with three iron anyway? Just sit. So that all depends on how far it's carried because there is semi rough up there. It was a bit toey, so I can't imagine it carrying very far. I mean, it, well, is, it is dry, so it might have bumped down a bit. You are finished for the day. <laughs> <laughs> Don't speak too soon, you never know. What do you think here? I'm thinking four iron, but I'm thinking four iron is also going to be pretty vital. So you, that's, the, that's a confident way of saying I don't want to lose it too early. <laughs> this first swing of the day. <laughs> this game's horrible. I'm going to go four iron, centre of the fairway. Have you got a longer iron in the bag, just in case you do lose that? I've got me seven wood. Seven wood? Yeah, oh, so yeah, that's... They say that's perfect for links. <laughs> it is this morning though, isn't it? <laughs> hey, to be fair, it hey isn't. you thought I was being an idiot, but I'm not. I knew what I was doing. Of course, I can't hit two iron. Right. <laughs> Centre of the fairway, fade in. I've got plenty of bail out, so it's a nice steady one to begin with. That'll do. That's a lovely shot, Pete. That'll do. I'll tell you what, what a strike. That was a great strike. Are you sure you didn't go to the range? I don't know what happened then. Well, I was getting ready. First shot of the day, that was an incredible strike. <laughs> Told you, this game just turned you into a scratch golfer. <laughs> I'm going to feel like a pro after today. <laughs> Now, in this video as well, myself and Carter are going to be talking you through how to play different shots, course management, to really help steer you in the right direction, hopefully. Um, <laughs> we've got 180 yards left in. Pin is on the right. That's not a nice yardage for a second shot, is it? No, it's like normally I'd say, oh, it's just a seven iron whack it, but I think it may be a six this morning. I mean, you're going to talk people through shots. So you can't just say mm. seven iron whack it. <laughs> <laughs> it's meant to be a tutorial, Pete. What do you mean? Come on. Is, is that is, not? Is uh, this the sort of thing he tells you, is it? You know what? I used seven to iron whack it. I used to charge for that. <laughs> <laughs> and, you're, and everyone's getting it for free. An absolute bargain. <laughs> right. We're going to go six iron. Now the ball is slightly above my feet. So I'm thinking I'm aiming center of the green. And if it draws a bit, then fine. I just don't want to obviously miss. I don't want to lose a club on the first hole. Me and Andy were in the gym yesterday. My bum, bum was a bit sore. 
<laughs> just add some context. No, no, to that actually, comment. no context needed. No context Please, needed. Please, let's add some context. No, to that no comment. I'm fine with that. <laughs> oh, Pete. I can't. I can't see if it's. I mean, it's online. Yeah, on I think green. it's front left. I think uh, front right. Sorry. Good shot. No clubs lost. No, I struck that. Um, I struck that pretty well as well. It's very safe though. Yeah, it was. Like if, if me and Carter were playing in this match, I would not be aiming there. Like <laughs> if this was a proper full-on YouTube vlog, I would be aiming at the pin and going for it. But it's not. And the missing left. This is all about <laughs> scoring, not being stupid. Pro Allow me just to remove Andy's three iron because he has missed the fairway. How far have we got? Here? I've got one fifty-five flag. That little slope behind the flag is 160, so it helps me with a bit of yardage. Try and figure out, try and get an understanding of the depth of the green. I like to zap front, middle, and back if I can. Okay. So I'm going to hit 165 club. He's an A time, so I'm going to hit an A time. Slightly into breeze, isn't it? Just slightly. Part of me is worried that I don't know how strong the breeze is up there. I'm going, I'm going pin seeking, Vinci. <laughs> oh, hello. Oh God, please be good. Kieran, can you see the ball on the green? Can't see it, no. That's not a good sign, is it? <laughs> I mean, it was all over the flag. Was it overdrawing though? It wasn't overdrawing. It was a little bit skinny, thinny, but okay-ish. You know that, talk, that awkward strike, bottom S groove strike. Skinny, thinny, but okay-ish, not overdrawing. Oh, he yes. got a thumbs up, wow, okay. Get in. Oh, Kieran, you're just full of it. Love See, this, it. Is, this is the thing, like, what's the tactic to use? Is it going to be survive with as many clubs as you can, or is For it me, going to be low scoring? If I try and play safe and try and play to the fat portion of the green, to me that's just so defensive that I'll start steering and hit bad shots. Got I've you. just got to try and play my own game and, miss, and hit bad shots anyway. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's only stroke play. It's the score that matters in the end, not how many clubs you lose. So, like, if Carter shoots level par, loses five clubs and I shoot one over losing not I'm like car still wins so exactly so you, there's got to be a got to be a better strategy in place go the, for it the problem is if you just don't go bomb it and like you but you lose your driver straight away then yeah uh. so also if you play too defensive off the tee to try and feel like you're going to keep the ball in play you're going to have long irons into greens and you start losing mid irons out of the yeah. bag you're in trouble oh needs to go needs to go that was pretty oh, slow. Wow. That was a weird, oh my God. I'll tell you what. I almost did like a U-shape and came backwards. Hell of, a pin, a hell of a pin position that today. <laughs> Crikey. What are you thinking? Um, well, it's definitely left to right. Left to right, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> how's, that, how's that confidence flowing now you see my put? Go, go, go. Nice <sighs> lag. Yeah. Oh, well done. I'll take par. One club down, par. It's okay. <laughs> it's a good trade. It's a good, it's a good trade off yes all right we're well, looking at your putt i think this is going to be left edge up the hill nice putt. tell you what that didn't want to move that was a good putt that stayed straight so level par level par but most importantly i've still got all my clubs well done pete thanks mate <laughs> you know what that is just a pretty golf hole it is a beautiful hole isn't it 116 yards to the flag but it's tricky. I know it's not. I know it's not very far, but the wind is right off our backs. So for us as right-handed golfers, left to right wind is the worst one, especially when we've got like such a lofted club. Well, we want to be getting this beyond the pin as well. It's going to spin. Yeah. Well, yeah, should do. I've got a gap wedge, <laughs> which goes 120, 125, it's yeah. 116. Do you hit it full? I I think it's fullish. Fullish, isn't it? Yeah. Back of the back of the green, let it spin. I can see the train line just to the well, obviously behind the green to the left. That's the line. Let the wind nudge it, pass the flag, rip it back. Oh, hole in one would look epic. I'll say nothing yet. Spin. Right, it's pin high, spin a bit. Yeah, it's okay. It's okay, it's okay. I get to keep the gap wedge in the bag. Very true. And I get to hole out for birdie. I mean, who am I? Who am I to, who am I to complain? <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm, I've got to be honest. I don't want to set myself up, but I think on this hole, Kieran, what do you reckon? I'd say six out of the 10 times I've played it, 
close to a hole in one. Really? Yeah. Yeah. I just there's, there's something about it I just love. I've never played it off this tee before, so. Ah, oh, there's a new hole. Oh, tracking. Oh, Peter. Honestly, they, like, every time, I think it's one of those holes that like, everyone's got this, they stand on a hole and like the good memories start to come back. I've, I've literally never hit a bad tee shot here. I'm more impressed that you managed to hit the ball off that high of a tee. <laughs> and take a divot. And take a divot. Come on, come on. <laughs> it was a great shot. We've all kept our clubs. Let's see if we get a birdie. It was a great shot. <laughs> right, two birdie putts. Right. I'm further away, but not much, not much movement in this. I think it's pretty straight down that slope. Straight down the hill, a little bit outside the left, but nothing major. We'll try and get the pace early doors now. Pace on the last putt was poor. Turn in, turn in, turn in. Yes. Calamity Jane, how that's all I imagined. All right, well, to keep pace. Suddenly looks a bit longer and a bit faster and a bit more breaking. <laughs> it's, ah, well, so it's downhill and it should move a little bit off to the right, but I think, depending on the pace I hit it, if I go at it relatively firm, it won't move. So you're gonna go firm downhill, yeah? <laughs> I'm gonna go inside left. Okay. Oh, it went. Oh, oh. See what I mean? Oh, oh, oh uh, give that one a marker clean and a line up again. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that's annoying. I'm lucky, Pete. That moved a lot, didn't it? Yeah, it did move more than I thought. It was always one of those which was kind of like on the edge. Oh, a bit of movement in the back. Are you seen this? I was getting the angles. Talk about tactics. <laughs> I was getting the angles. Listen, you pay me to bring birdies and man a camera. There's going to be some downforce to it. <laughs> can't, can't get both, can we? <laughs> can't have both. Can't have both. All right, you either want birdies or you want the angles. Hey, you can't have everything. <laughs> This looks narrow, doesn't it? Uh, you know, in terms of fairway. If it, yeah. Obviously, because of the game we're playing, it looks narrow. If otherwise, I'm, I'd be confident just to bomb a driver and kind of yeah, we'll figure the next one out, even if it's in the rough. I mean, with 340, we could probably get quite close. But, but there's holes on this back nine where a driver is necessary. Like it, the last, definitely, yeah. we'll be saving it to that if we can. I've got three wood out. I'm usually very, very good with a three wood. I think, I think three wood's a good call. I think three wood's a good call. So nervous over that. Oh, no, that's a good shot. Is that good? There are very, very <laughs> few games which will <laughs> elicit a fist bump for it in a three wood in a fairway. Honestly, I was nervous because I was thinking if I lose my three wood on this hole, then I'm down to driver and four iron. Four iron's going to be tricky. Driver could get lost straight away. Brilliant. Right, same tactic three wood. Come on, fairway. Oh. I tell you what, we are on fire today. I couldn't see it, mate. I was too busy manning the camera. Well, let me tell you, I was banging in the middle of the fairway. Great shot, mate. Loads of green to work with, which is nice, but we want to be aggressive. We need birdies. Um, that pin is right at the back. It's if right you're at the back. So aggressive and you miss, you're off the back and you're losing a wedge. So. Yeah, but I want to, I want to fly at 90. I don't want to go 95. I want to go 90. Uh, I'm going to go 54 degree. OK. I'm going to stiff it. <laughs> oh, the confidence. I'd like to say it's infectious, but I think it's just misplaced. But no, we are, we're all we playing all right this morning. We're playing all right. We we play, I feel all right. like I played all week. I feel like I played decent enough. Problem is, I don't know how hard to swing a 54 degree for 90 yards. It's all feel. It's all feel. Sit. 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 Has it hung on or is it fringe? It's a great shot. I think that's fringe. That's gone. I only swung it to about here. How has that gone 95 yards? See adrenaline. <laughs> Just pumped up. That's a great shot. I'm, I'm holding that. Oh, it's easy. It's about, it's about 10 foot on. He's volunteered to man the camera on the green. I think he's going to kick it back from the fringe, but maybe that's just my negative outlook on life. Is it on? Yeah. 70 yards. See, the way cars kicked on, these greens are still so firm here. Like we're middle of October in Scotland, but the greens are just pure. I'm thinking like a 54 degree, half a swing, land it short of the flag and just release it up as such. I don't want to go kind of crazy and right over the back. So just half a swing, nippy one. Oh, 
yeah, flew flew a little bit further than I wanted. Kind of popped up a bit higher as well, but that's left me about six foot. So all the clubs are still in the bag and another birdie chance. I don't want to say it too loudly, but I think we might get through nine holes here. Beautiful Scottish links. Now, by the way, how good are these greens? Because my ball landed behind where Finch is and it's released all the way up to here. Don't know if that's me or the actual greens, but <laughs> they are very nice and firm anyway. Yeah, they are. Such a beautiful view this morning. All right, so for car, two in a row. I think I've got a carbon copy of the last putt. I'm wondering if it maybe even goes right to left at the very end though. Eef, like it's in like a smidgen. Yeah. But it might go, I think it's going to go that way first. Little double breaker, eh? Cool. What have I done to deserve that? Don Donald's just throwing everything at you this morning. I just keep batting it back. <laughs> Oh, pasted it. Just a bit firm, yeah. Yeah, pasted it. I was like, it went then. I was like, that's in. It's got to be in. And it never came back because it was going at 100 miles an hour. If you three put as well, you lose your putter. Shut up. <laughs> Not this thing. It's my favourite club. <laughs> Don't know how. <laughs> Not loads, but just a touch. But I'm, I'm with you. Like at the end, it looks like it. It does go like it's going to go a bit more from your side, left to right. No, it's definitely going to move left. And I think it's going to, it's going to move left and I think it's going to stay straight at the it's end. It's going to move so left? It's going what? to go Right this. to left? Yeah. To begin with, just going to move a touch that way. And then it might move a little bit that way. So it's a straight pump. <laughs> oh. Ouch. Ouch. We both lipped out. One par is secure though. Ah. Uh. Ouch, just went, uh, I don't know if I just pulled that, it went left very quickly, that straight off the face. So. Oh well, par secure, oh, steady. Guys, I'm sorry everyone for Andy's, Andy's camera work. How many cameras do you need? I promise you if you go over to his channel. Over to mine, we're just straight up, one camera, Birdieville, that's all you need. <laughs> oh, we'll call that a good putt. You know, the psychology then was like, don't pull it left. I was fully expecting think, a push. <laughs> if you don't, don't push it right then, pull it a little bit. Good putt. All right, we have scores on the doors, one under, one club lost, level, no clubs lost. So one under's leading. 13th hole, uh, 300 and... 80 yards probably back to the pin because it's on the back. There's a water hazard in front of the green. It's a relatively wide fairway this, but it's always, <laughs> whenever there's one side which is out of bounds, it's always tempting to use the right side. The railway tracks to the left. I can't be honest, I think that three wood is probably a good shout again. It's, I was not, it's not a driver. Just, I was just um, figuring out what I could do with maybe a four iron. Four iron. But I I just, I, there's no need to hit a four iron. It's three wood all day. <sighs> This fairway as well, it's got a lot of like humps and ridges in. So if you hit a four iron and you catch the back of one, you can actually yeah, get it scooting and a long it, way. And it's but, downwind. But if you hit it into one of the banks, you're going to be left with a long approach. So I feel like a four iron, I can just start it inside that right bunker and just turn it over into the middle of the fairway and just get down there yeah. stress-free. I think it's a five iron or a driver. Guys, get down into those comments below. Get down and let me know your handicap and let me know how many clubs down you would be by now. What a nice moment. Just customer, isn't it? You gotta wave yeah. at people. I, I, I reckon I made someone's day there. Yes. Oh, oh, draw, draw. Nice shot. You knew straight away. It wasn't the best strike in the world. Bit toey, was it? But it's right in the middle of the fairway, and I am safe, and it's over to you here. Yeah. Pressure mounts again. Split the fairway. Yeah, I think three wood's the right play, because I think three wood as well. Like realistically, every other hole from here, you don't need to hit three wood. So if it is a loss of a three wood, probably okay. Because you drive on the next. That's a negative. Just talking about the loss of it is a negative. <laughs> yeah, you're probably right, actually. Yeah. Okay. Already thinking about the, the potential loss of his three wood. I'm already thinking about boxing my second shot tonight. <laughs> that's, a, that's a leap as well. Oh, the pins in the top. Oh, whoa, oh. He was, a, he was a millimeter away from topping it. Oh, where's oh. that going? I've got miles into the rough. And I think that might be in the semi, you know. Yep. That felt like, that went like 50 past mine. Yeah, it was just... And it landed at the front edge of the fairway. Well, I did this um, 
I did this yesterday. I, I must be getting like mega steep on my three wood. Cause I thought I topped a three wood yesterday, but it was felt a bit weird cause it didn't feel like a top. I think I must be getting here. I think you hit it out of the heel, the hosel. I must be getting there like impact and just like driving it down. It went, it's ended up going like it's rolled further than it was in the air. Oh, 100%. I mean, that's not hard actually. I'll take that back. It's that was... called tactics. Uh, right, three wood is out. Now off the fairway. 120. It's a really awkward pin that. Dangerous Downwind. Pin that. Just like a, a gap wedge. Very similar shot to um, to the par three. It's really awkward because I don't want to land it in that upslope because it'll come down. And that pin where it is, like a put from the lower level, is just fruity. The negativity from start to finish on this hole is outrageous, isn't it? Three wood, I'm going to lose it. This is such a hard hole. You know what? It's 115, flags there, grab a club, bosh. That's all you gotta do. And then He's you deal right. with the, then deal with right. the consequences afterwards. You know what? I've known Carter for a long time and some things never change. That is how he like literally loses life. That's how I live my life. I'm gonna do this and I'm gonna deal with the consequences afterwards. <laughs> there have been some sticky consequences back in the days. <laughs> <laughs> Again, wanna to, want to, uh, qualify that? No, not really. <laughs> I actually didn't think of it like that. <laughs> Get on it. There you go. I'm literally coaching my opponent through this. I've got to be honest, I'm, like, as we just mentioned, known Carter for a long time, this is the most sensible that he, you have ever been. You, since you've had a kid, you're a new man. I know. It's Never true. known anything like it. It's true. James, I stopped last night after two drinks. Two bottles? Yeah, they're, they're drinks. <laughs> 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 it's like basically as I'm talking to you, I'm, it's like I'm just I'm nodding off. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh god! Well, that would mean you're falling asleep at the things you're <laughs> saying. <laughs> you're you're boring yourself so much, you're falling asleep. Oh god! god. Right, right. right what one, we got? Gav wedge. One fifteen. I got a sandwich. Oh, sandwich. One fifteen. So let these guys pass. Yeah. Bloody busy, they all commute. Oh, actually, it's lunchtime. My angle's hard, way harder than yours, but I'm just gonna smash and grab. Your angle's way harder than mine. My angle's harder, yeah? No. Please be the right club. <gasps> oh. Wow. We have a twist. Bye bye, oh, sandwich. That was ripped. That was ripped. It's your favourite wedge, that's all right. Oh, the consequences. I'm rubbish with this, to be fair. <laughs> it's time to deal with the consequences, Andy. Time to deal with the consequences. <laughs> Goodbye, farewell. <laughs> you know what, I reckon that suits a nice little sandwich bumper running to the slope. Oh no, <laughs> wait a minute. That is like, from a course management perspective, that's the worst place to miss. <laughs> it's it is, uh, yeah. FYI. That yeah. is a steep slope coming back. Honestly, I was, if it was pitching here, Probably goes in. Yeah, so the back of this green, I'll get quite low behind the pin so you can see this, but it comes Yeek. up the slope and then it's all the way down. This is, this is not easy, this one, mate. And I've got a sprinkler right in my way, so I need to just miss the sprinkler, get it here and it's straight down yonder. Done a pretty good turn, job turn, there. Turn, turn, turn. <sighs> Stop. Yeah, it's just, I'm happy with that, to be fair. For all those on a touch, that's a really good shot, that. I'm really happy with that, because I was kind of worried. I thought to myself, you have to get it on the green, worst case, make bogey. But you didn't want it coming back to your feet. No. Right, this is... This is a This is a, this is a hard putt. This is a slippery one. Wow. This is massive right to left and down the slope. Because mine didn't. Mine came over that crest with very little pace and made it past the hole. Yeah. I'm going to have to like come up here and just like try and drip it. Oh, wow. So fast. Wow. Well, like, literally the only way of stopping that is hitting oh, the hole. Yeah. I can't, one, I can't believe it's missed low. Yeah. Two, I can't believe that I'm closer in three. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it, it's taken a little bit of me to get used to as well, actually. Good putt. Dripping it in. Oh. Good putt. Good save in the end. <laughs> it's a good rescue. It's just so stressful, isn't it? It's so stressful. Oh. Guys, if you are enjoying this video as well, these are the challenges you love to see. Or wall up that like button. In about finishing the yeah, it's fine. It's in the bottom of the hole. It's fine. <laughs> wall up that like button. Ooh. Subscribe to the channel. I'm enjoying this match. 
It's been fun. I'm, I'm enjoying it too. It's a very good concept, Peter. Oh, okay. Stroke play. Did you come up with it? <laughs> Stroke play. <laughs> what we're going to do, we're going to play a game where we count every shot. Yeah, that's unbelievable. No, are you joking? Maybe, yeah, maybe yeah. That. Oh, that's incredible. All right, par five. Is it driver time? Yeah, I think so. Why have I never played this all before? I played 15, but I've never played 14. No? Uh, is it driver? Yeah, it's mm. 500 I think it is driver, but it's risky. Well, if it's risky, I'm in. Deal with the consequences later. And why am I worried anyway? Don't, we don't miss fairways, do we, Pete? No, that's very true. We're fairway hitters. That's very good. Yes. Relief. Right down the middle. Love the shot, mate. Thanks, mate. Very good. Is it a driver or is it a seven wood? It's an absolute driver down the middle of the fairway. Why are you so negative? Why are you so scared of yourself? <laughs> Once it's gone, it's gone. <laughs> this is a new driver. I want to use it as much as I can. Deal with the consequences later. Anyway, right. Come on, Pete. Positivity. Five. Same shot, space out of that bunker, little cut. Oh. No, that's beautiful. That's hammered as well. That'd be good, that. Sure. Yeah, fair way at the edges is like that. Yeah. That was that was that was that was tracking right, I'll be honest. The fairway goes like that. The only thing I'm thinking is I remember on the right hand side. There's like these really mad swales. And again, that greenkeeper who we've annoyed with the pin positions has let a patch of rough grow, which is like semi rough, semi. Because I remember I being you, in there last time. Yeah, I'm not, I'm, I'm not overly confident for you there, I'll be honest. If really? it's missed that and it's kicked person. in, then it's massive, because that was a good strike. Okay. Well, you know what, Pete? Worst comes to worst, I'll coach you through the next phase. Let me just get into position. Right. Oh, Peter. I know, I did. So that, I hit that, because I thought it took a bit of a weird bounce. So it's pitched into that that little patch. I'm going to call that Pete's patch because I've been here about six times by now. God. Yeah, not in a good way. <laughs> so Peter has lost his driver. That's two clubs each now, isn't it? Yeah, but I think, I've, I think I've lost the fun ones, to be honest with you. So basically, you've lost driver and... Three wood. Three wood. <laughs> two, oh, three. Advantage of this hitting in, it's par five, so... It's a green in reg, so even if we miss the green with our approaches here, we still get to keep those clubs. And he's just making up as he goes along, isn't he, eh? Just made that up. <laughs> if you miss a green in regulation, you lose the club. This is a par five. Got the hardest game in the world. You're trying to make it harder. Oh, um, right, Vichy, you've got 200 yards to go. You can lay up and then chip on and save your clubs. Ah, it's just shifting. It'll be all right. Ah. Sorry. There it is. Wow, it's huge as well. Oh, oh God, you'll do well to hit the green from there. 203. You're going to have, what, 160? 145. 145, mate. Nah, 165. 165. <laughs> what are you going in with? I've got a 9 iron, which is weird, because obviously 40 yards ago you were hitting an 8 iron, but I've not got your launch pad. Um, well, the, the massive athlete is not so massive anymore. <laughs> uh, yeah, I think it's like a nice, smooth 9 iron, 165. It's a 155 club, downwind, 10 yards. Okay. Just up and down, really. Where are we headed? It's on the flag. Oh, is it? That looks awesome. That was awesome. That pins in a little depression, but I think that's going to be very so, close. So is the ball. This game's not so hard anymore, is it? Right, so just left of the green, pin high. He's there, little bunker to go over, up to the flag. See mine nestled in there quite nicely at around 10 feet. I mean, I feel like... Minimum you have to get up and down. Yeah, at this stage, this is like vital now. And you've got to hit the green. Well, I mean, let's hope, let's hope we can do that. What wedge have you got? Uh, 58. Oh, I just want to be landing it just before this slope. It's going to kill it a touch and then... Yeah, it's quite an interesting one with the, with the break from left to right as well, isn't it? Yeah, it's a bit of a tricky one, because if I pitch it too far, it goes into that slope, it's just going to kill it, so... Just pitched it after it, missed it. Ooh. Wow. Ooh. Still me. <laughs> You have not lost your turn. Not lost it. <laughs> Trying to be safe. He didn't want to lose his 58. <laughs> I'm going to need it. Oh, that slope there. That's what I was Ah, oh, damn. I mean, I could have opened the upper toucher, maybe flopped it, but that would have made me a bit twitchy. Well, these are, by the way, that flag's in another brutal position. It literally feels like it's on the side of a hill. Yeah. I mean, the greens here are pretty slopey, but you're right. Some of the pins have been. Ah. Wow. Just wasn't, just wasn't focused on it. Just wasn't, it. wasn't concentrating. Have a break. 
Yeah, I think I will. <laughs> have a break. <laughs> let, me, let me just have a moment to myself. Oh, Come on, I want to see an eagle here, mate. Let's roll yeah. around. Now, this is to get to three under as well. That'd be yeah. a really good score. Die, 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 die. Oh. Give it too much respect. Unlucky. <sighs> Tap it in. Two under, though. Still good, Two mate. Under. Easiest bird you'll have in a while, that. That is indeed. <laughs> wow. <laughs> What a pin! <laughs> wow, that broke. To be fair, it just about made the hole. I thought it was going to be short, wasn't you? Yeah. I... Wow, brutal. He's on the edge, folks. Jeez, that is living life on the edge at he, the moment. He's rattled. It's the only thing like about this game. I am now. I'm hanging on, but I'm. I'm. All, I need you to make mistakes. Like if I have a few birdies, great. But I'm relying on you making mistakes now. That's the spirit. That's the spirit, isn't it? That's the spirit of the game. Carl's messaging everybody he knows. He's like, guys, I can't believe it. I'm too under. I can't believe it. <laughs> One seven five. Aaron in the background, kind of down off the left a touch. What are you thinking? Well, it shouldn't be too down because that was down. But it should be more left to right. More left. I'm gonna go a little seven iron. Like it. Um, green looks big enough though. I don't know what you're worried about. Right. Right. I'm going just left of the flag at that uh, railway track mast. I'm just going to just try and get a good connection That's so the wind doesn't uh, hurt it too much. Let it drift off to the right. Oh, nudge it, wind. Just nudge it, nudge a, it a little bit. I'll do. Very good shot again. Thanks. Slight pull. A bit disappointed about that. Hey, playing I'm, well. I'm playing really, really well. Playing like a professional golfer. <laughs> what was that, seven? Yeah. That was a. Uh, Might have been. Pulled it a little bit. It's kind of finished where I wanted to start it. But, hey, you know what? That's a couple of yards between friends. A bit of thin, that, as well? Or? No, it's absolutely pure, excuse you. So it was a bit thin. It wasn't um, thin in the slightest. Right. <laughs> Same thing. So I started on that. That sign, just letting it drift. Uh-oh. Oh, cut hard. Sit. Ah. Uh-oh. That is a seven iron down. <laughs> Oh, wow, sit. Oh. It's really annoying. That's literally my best strike of the day as well. I always rip my pulls. <laughs> always rip they them. They do say pulls do go further, Peter. I think, I think I might approach golf in a completely different way from now on. I was going to aim 20 yards left, try and hit a fade. Just hit a 20 yard further pull. It's a, it's a way so of play. aim right then. It's what I've learned from today. Aim right at the target, aim for a fade and just hit a 20 yard pull. Ah, oh, bye seven. <laughs> Tricky little well, longish chip across the green. Oh, there's my ball. Hello. <laughs> How did that end up there? <laughs> to that flag there. It's probably going to be quite quick, actually, isn't it? It's it going downhill, downwind. Just, yeah, it's going to be yeah downhill, downwind, left to right. So it's just kind of getting it, getting it shifting. 58. Wow, what a bounce. What a bounce. That was firm, wasn't it? Oh, it's going down the ledge. It's gone down the ledge. It's gone down the slope. It's at Kieran's feet. Kieran's had to move out of the way. What Remember, did that hit? Just in case the ball's gone out of focus, let me zoom in. <laughs> I'd, there it is. I don't know what to say. Looking at your chip, I do not want to go past the hole. It's a good bit left to right though. I've picked my spot, about two cups left. That's good. Hold on. Oh. oh, lucky. I thought I had that. Apparent. But again, it's another hole down, another Nothing part, lost. no Nothing clubs lost. lost. Very good, very good stuff. I felt, I felt like I had that, that, that broke a lot. Well, we can tell a serious one, take practice strokes. <laughs> oh, he's done it. He's held as a massive foot. Practice strokes. <laughs> Makes all the difference. If you're ever in doubt, <laughs> take your practice strokes. Oh, you should do some putting videos. Just to, just to let people know about You know that. what? No, I'm going to I'll leave a link to some putting videos that I've already done, which are absolute bangers. So go watch them, and I guarantee you'll never three put again. I'll tell you something, he holds one put and he starts advertising his bloody putting you, videos. You've had Jeez. two birdies. You, I've you, got some great seven irons from 175 videos on par threes. He had, he's literally <laughs> had two birdies. You should have seen him on WhatsApp to his group. Guys, I've never seen anything like it. I am absolutely striking it, ripping it. If I'm honest, I, I actually texted him, so I was a little bit disappointed, but I'll take it. He didn't text, he was a voicemail as well. <laughs> so you won't believe what I'm doing! Unbelievable golf! <laughs> so, it's 400 yards, I've only got a seven wood left. 
I'm struggling to clear that bunker at about 200 yards into this wind. Um, where well, you go, three? I'm going to go three wood just so I can take out the furthest bunker. Yeah, that's probably not a bad idea. Try and like plot it in there. Oh, it was fizzed, but it might be finding a bit of rough. Yeah. That's going to be semi left. Bye, seven wood. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was like flight wise. Great flight, great strike. It was oh. a very similar pull to the last hole. Yeah. 20 yards. Getting the pulls later in the day. Tiredness, isn't it? It's not like we've got 80 <laughs> more holes to go. Tiredness creeping in. Bunker 280 to clear, so I'm going to aim at it because I definitely can't get there, obviously. So it should be enough fairway for me to hit. Get on from this angle and spin around. Oh my God. Oh my God. Where is it? I That's right. on I the felt, railway. It, it, felt, it felt right, I'll be honest. I thought I was... <laughs> it felt right. It felt very right. I felt like I was there. That is literally on Western Gales. It felt, it felt there. <laughs> it felt there. It felt right, I'll be honest. Right. That right. is right. going to be a lost ball. Does that mean I lose this club now? That means you lose the club. What, for now? Yeah, because that, that's gone. That's a lost ball. Do we not need to identify the fact that it's out of bounds? If that is not out of bounds, I will eat your three wood. <laughs> that was so far right. Yeah, it felt You've honestly, been playing so well. Where did that come from? I've just got that in me, haven't I? Actually, I didn't see it, so I should just ignore it happened. <laughs> it won't be in your subconscious anyway. I just, I just felt it. <laughs> oh, that's going to be... That We're might be missing left. It's my third shot, so it doesn't count. That's fine. That is going to be fine, but I don't think that's on the fairway. It doesn't matter. My third shot. Not a chance. It's not my tee shot. You just reloaded it's, off the tee. Yeah, it's my third shot. It's your first shot. Oh, what, it doesn't count, does it not? No. Hey, right. three wood down, driver down. Driver's there. Not a chance. No. Not a chance. I'm, I may have missed the green in regulation. That is shocking. That <laughs> is shocking. He's trying to cheat, guys. Anyone Making who's, the rules up as he goes Anyone along who's hopped over to his channel to subscribe. <laughs> Unsubscribe. Cheat. What a cheat. Thanks, manager. Now, this just shows the brutality of this game. Carter was flying high, sailing off to the shore of two under and an easy victory. Now he's a three wood down and about to lose maybe two shots. I'll, I'll, I'll let you keep your driver because that is not an official rule, but you are off the fairway. But I also missed the green in regulation though. It ruins, it ruins that rule. It's better just to have snapped hooked a massive three wood. No, 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 if you, if you miss the green, you lose that club. You're not well, having not, that. It's not in regulation, though. No, you're not having that. It's not in regulation. The, the whole, no, the tee shot is reset. Stop trying to... You play it well. Stop trying, first, stop trying to spoil it because, by cheating Because now. my first golf ball... No, come on. Come on, stop trying to cheat. Desperation. This is, stop this, trying to cheat. This is you, you've, earned a, you've earned a lot of fans so far today. Don't ruin it <laughs> by being a cheat. You um, Don't ruin it. You told me my first ball was, out of, out, was gone. That's, that's why I went to another one. You've just delayed the train from Glasgow. Is that far right? I didn't, I didn't realise this game would lead to a massive falling out. For you, man. A massive YouTube controversy. This is, this is, this is, even, this, is rule ma <laughs> this is making up rules as we go down to a T. No, I'm sorry. How far have you got? I've got like 220 yards. Wow. With a four, it's not going to reach. No, not into wind. I don't know whether it's better to like sacrifice. Have, I would sacrifice another club because you're going to need that off the tee next. Sacrifice like a five iron. Sacrifice five iron. Try and like hit a hook or something. Try and get it up there. So you see what happens there, guys? I help Finchie out with his game because he's a couple of shots behind. The minute I put a foot wrong, he's on me. What? New rules, new rules, changing what? them, adapting them. Right. Telling me my golf ball's Listen, dead. Guys, you can get down into those comments below and let me know if you think I'm being exceptionally kind and let you You've keep always, your driver. We've all got friends like that, haven't we? It's just desperation. It's fine though. Great strike. That four iron would have made it with that flight. It's got to be short. So I'm just relying on an up and down, really, and you messing it up. <laughs> I get up and down for bogey. We half the hole. Yours isn't a guarantee to get on the fairway, uh, to get on the green from there. I mean, admittedly, it is like 50 is. yards closer. It's a lot closer. <laughs> 184 flag. 160 front. Hell, it's still a hell of a hole, isn't it? Yeah. That's a big green, isn't it? I feel like 184 flag is, if it's 160 green, flag's at the very, very back edge. Even though it's into wind, a punchy five iron to the flag would be good. Yeah. It's... But if I pure a five and go over the back, it's not good. I'm going to go six iron. Just trying to get on that second ridge. Yeah. 
all over it. Oh, go on, go on. Stay there, stay there, stay there, stay there. Sit. That's so pure. I think he's made the front. Just, uh, oh, front yeah, of the green? Yeah, nice shot, mate. Very front, good. Front of the green? Yeah. All oh, right, I thought it was on the second tier. No, no, it's just oh, made right. the front. <laughs> I was Literally like, just I was made saying, the front. <laughs> I was saying sit thinking it's going over the back. I think right. like, unbelievable. <laughs> I thought you made him spin it off, right? No. no. Oh, that's a shame. Well, you good. get to keep it. I, you're saying good shot, I'm good to be. <laughs> I mean, I'm in a tough spot here because I've got one, two, three, four. I've lost five, Carter's lost three. Ooh, so I've you, only got two clubs. You lose one more and you're done? No, two. Oh, two. Two, yeah. If I lose two clubs, I'm done. Is that rule change as well? Pete's sending poor Kieran up there to check the wind on the green. <laughs> can, you, can you give us a measurement, please, Kieran? Right. That's a great second shot. Uh, well, third shot. Fourth shot? Fourth shot. God knows. Fourth shot. Fourth shot. It was a good shot, that. Be good to get down into. Take the double and run. Go. Go. Ooh. That's not a great shot, that. It wasn't ideal. It wasn't very aggressive. No, it bit. wasn't. I, I was almost like slowed a touch, don't know why. Very tentative, very safe. Yeah, not my best, that. In the, in the context of the match as well. Yeah, you should be going, you should be putting some serious pressure on him by making the par. It's not made no, it. Well left, well left. Well, it has made it. I mean, it's pin eye. You know what? Over the ball, I was like, oh, I don't know if it's going to go that far right to left. Ah, shut up, stupid game. <laughs> just shut up. Pin eye. I just like, said it, quality I, ball I read it perfectly, then second guessed it, and then pulled it. A lot of, a lot of problems. There's a lot of issues in that. Problem is, it's psychological warfare with yourself. You're not even fighting anymore. Yeah, no one's even, no one's even getting in my head. It's all me. <laughs> I think this is just going to go right to left at the end. You hold out and I miss, you go one shot clear. I mean, how's that worked? <laughs> oh, life. Life and golf, what a funny mess. Pulled it as well. Pulley pull. Oh, oh, wow, pulled it and raced it. Yeah. Tell you what, it's getting a bit tense, isn't it? Oh, it's pretty straight up the hill. Not much in this at all. Firm, dead center. What a great putt. That was a really good putt, that. Oh, thanks. I called it as well. Nice, nice stroke. Boom. Very good. Dead centre. Double bogey. Oh! oh. oh that was a push off the face. It came off right. That yeah. was a push straight off the it face. It came off right. But I think literally aiming left centre saved me there. Because that came off right. <laughs> Man. Wowza. Right, one shot in it. <laughs> If how, far you hit, how far is the hole? 400 into it. Yeah, driver, you'll have to wave kind of left of those bunkers and kind of pray that it finds a fairway. So it's probably a layup. It's so negative. If I, no, if I was going to offer some actual proper advice here, if you hit driver, like the fairway narrows as it goes, you can bomb it left, but you want, you really do want driver up the last. So. Yeah, but you're not necessarily getting home in two on 18 with nothing else in the bag other than a driver and a four iron. Oh, I think you are. Yeah, driver. Driver four oh, iron, yeah. yeah. It's downwind. But from and you're a big boy. So you want me to hit a four iron with you, Pete, yeah? No, what, I'll show you. The... <laughs> you play the all over you want, but all I'm saying is that is probably the best play. What's the, um, the bunkers on the left then? To clear them is 213. Yeah, we're going to the... Are we aiming at the heather on the right? Yeah, yeah. Oh, no. Oh, no. Turn over. Hook around. Just not the, that's not the play, that. That. Might be in the semi. Yeah. Oh, it doesn't, I mean, it doesn't really matter if I lose it, to be fair. No, I mean, you've got, you've got a close to spare. Oh, oh, stay there, round. stay there, stay there. I hope that's fair way. Has that cleared him? Oh, no, it's, it, I, I, I knew it was going to be short. I just don't know if the fairway goes around that much. Oh, no. It, it sounded pure. I thought that was oh, no, the line I, you were going. I thought, no, he, I, he I, just cheated me out of a line here. No, again, I'll keep it in there for now. No, again, it's the struck it great. So obviously I pulled it. <laughs> <laughs> Makes sense. Yeah. Right, so I'm delighted to report, to report Finchy has missed the fairway by three foot. <sighs> and he's also man. lost his four iron. That's devastating. Um, so what are you doing an issue five now? Because one, two, three, four, five, six. So I've only got two clubs I can lose. So if you don't hit the green here in regulation, 
that that's gives me seven. one club down the last. And if you don't hit the fairway off the tee shot down the last, you lose. I mean, I've got a six. I mean, I've got a six iron here. I don't think that's enough to get home. Is that you? You don't got a five iron? No, I've got. Oh, you don't got a five iron. Literally coming down the last, I might have to hit seven iron, seven iron, seven iron, and hope I don't miss. So I could finish the finish the actual comp. <laughs> Oh, wow, he's brutal. That is brutal. These are your rules as well. I know. I'm, sure, I'm, I'm going to change them. I'm sure they'll change at some <laughs> point over the next 10 minutes. So I'm going to have to try to literally snap hook a six to get it back there. Go on, get back there. Go on. Couldn't have played that any better. How are we looking? I don't see a ball on the green. Sorry. You are sorry? I don't see a ball on the green. Doesn't see a ball on the green. But that's car. He might not be pointing at the right green. If I could hit the fairway, the four iron would have been okay. Yeah, it's not good that we both missed the uh, fairway with the four iron. By the way, no, that's I'm, less than ideal. So I need to take that out. Yeah, take that out. I mean, you've got clubs to burn, so six iron. Oh, I've got five iron. <laughs> Spoil for choice. <laughs> Way too many clubs. I can't get there though. So I'm, I mean, I'm going to. I'm about. That's the thing. So you had this predicament on the last. Yeah. I can't reach, it's 215 to the front edge of the green. That I would probably just about make five iron with a bit of a flyer. That's a bit of a flyer lie. So I'm gonna, it's actually worth the gamble because I've got to drive a six iron down the last. Yeah, I'd say that's good. There's no point in a six and laying up to use a five down the last. We're relying on a flyer five. I need a flyer that's... five with a bit of draw. It's a flyer, but it's still missing it's a flyer. Oh, no, hold, it's hold, hold, hold. Bunker bound, I think. Yeah, bunker. Bunker. It's all right, I love bunkers. If it's in the middle of it. Up and down. Lose that club though. Stick it in. Put it in the bin of shame over Goodbye, here. Goodbye, my lover. Goodbye, my friend. <laughs> you have been the one. Have you, lost, have you lost seven clubs then? Yeah, so I've got so literally... You, got one more, you lose one more club. And I'm out. Can't You're finish. You're out. I'm, I'm really... I'm gutted. I thought I did a really good shot. Just crept in the bunker. Yeah, yours was coming sideways. Yeah, way, yeah. If it had just started out a bit more right, that on my front edge. What would, have been, what would have been more entertaining, a bit funnier, is the fact that it actually it still wouldn't have reached the green. It'd have been like a centimetre off. <laughs> it just absolutely <laughs> killed me. Uh, right. I'd have made the green as well with that five iron. Oh yeah, yeah. It came out really dead, didn't it? It did, yeah. So two lob wedges. You still got yours, yeah? Uh, still got it. Like wedges, not a problem. Right, I've got 58. Up and down would be nice here. Just a little par. It's flown it. Is it okay? That's long. Oh, yeah. Yeah, the... <laughs> oh. I fancied wow. that. I tried to nip it so tight that it went high and just stopped dead. I was a millimetre of sand away from probably pulling it. Bloody hell, Kieran. <laughs> At least we know it's gone long. Thanks, Kieran. Thanks, Kieran. Like, <laughs> thanks for that confirmation. <laughs> well, where would we be without you? Ah, oh, safe. Taking his bogey. Yeah, I've, I've, I've got to be honest. Like <laughs> seeing your shot first did not make that shot any easier. <laughs> I'm normally like I'm so confident, so happy. Yeah. In the like I just bit off a little bit too much golf ball. Oh, that was so safe. That. It feels like this is now, it's turned into less of like a stroke play, more of a semi-match semi play. It's a match play damage limitation yeah, now. Exactly. I'll tell you what, I think we should I think we should lose our wedges for those shots, to be honest with I you. need mine for my next. It's true. I, I need mine so I don't lose. Wow, okay. You know what, I'm so disappointed with I'm not so much with what I've got to play now, just like, I'm normally so comfortable in bunkers. Yeah. That was just such a disappointing shot. No, I know. I know how you feel. I feel the same way. I, I would back myself to get that closer 10 times out of 10 if I'd have gone first. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, right. Right. It was popped on you. Yeah, it did. It's next to yours, that. Well, this is disappointing. <laughs> Bloody hell. Dead cheap, that, mate. Hey? Dead cheap. Dead cheap. Still you. Oh, God, the disappointment, honestly. Yeah, good layup. Good lag. I had visions of a three-putt just to finish off this hole. <laughs> <laughs> where's, that, where's that confident guy gone? Uh, oh, two we, time. We nice. left him on the tee four holes ago, I think. <laughs> oh, that's back-to-back -back double bogeys. Oh, two over par. Back-to-back -back doubles. How did that just happen? Right, so if I two-put this, will level go down the last? Yeah. Except there is a slight advantage to you. I've <laughs> only got an eight iron. Yeah, if you two put, 
level down the last, but you cannot miss the fairway or green in regulation. Go, turn! <laughs> oh my God. I literally thought that was in the whole way. Oh. When you hit it, I was like, I know this is going in. Just like in the middle, it's straight and This is, just, this is just typical Finch. <laughs> <laughs> well, we are level going down the last. I didn't think we'd be saying that a few no. holes ago. <laughs> Me neither. I thought, it'd be over, I thought it'd be over by now. Car to talk to us. What's the lay of the land on this last so, hole? So, so, so. You've got the longest club you've got left is an eight iron peak. So I'm going to hand that over to you. Thanks, mate. Appreciate that. I've managed to preserve my driver. Now, there's a bit of a build up on the driver because we've been talking about this for the whole vlog. So I can literally bomb this anyway. It doesn't matter where it goes as long as I don't lose my golf ball. But at the same time, I need to leave myself a second shot in. But that's the widest fairway we've played so far. Yeah, you've got- It's exciting. You've got clubs to burn. Like how many could you lose? Three on this last hole, something like that? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, something like that. I'm, I can I'm, not, not, worried about, I'm not worried about the losing of the clubs. Just the loss of the match. Just <laughs> loss of the match and the ball. So, due to go as well, actually. Oh, fuck do you want to yeah. nestle your little eighteen down there? Yeah, I'll just get a little, a little pump down there. Now, you can't hit that 20-yard pull again. No, I'm hoping with an eight iron I'll be all right, but... Well, you'd managed to hit the seven before. Oh, that would have hit this fairway, though, would it? <laughs> <laughs> you'd hope so. Right, step one, yeah, hit eight iron. I mean, in terms of the width of the hole, you shouldn't, be, you shouldn't have an issue. you just got to try and power this down there as far as possible. Well, what is this? So it's 518, so 165, 165. Literally three eight times. Lovely strike. I'm not gonna lie, it felt a little bit weird having an eight iron out on that tee. Did it? <laughs> Can't imagine why. You need to hit, so three one six five shots don't make it to the green, so you lose your club. Uh, but it's downwind. That's what I mean. So you need you need two of them to go at least like one seventy five, one eighty. Yeah, that'll be fine. To bring the third shot into range. Yeah, you worry about me. Yeah, there's no there's no pressure on this drive. You just wallop it now. 346 bunker, we we'll have to get over that. All right, a little cutty one, wind off the left. It's not nice cut, light. It? It's not cut. A little bit left, but. Skip that bunker, didn't it? It skipped it. I don't know. Oh, that ooh, was so pure. I hit that so pure. That was a no spin fly, that. That was, that was so lovely. pure. It just did not move an inch in the air. It was so, but I think it bounced the foot. I think it bounced that bunker. So 280, 28, yeah, it's probably bounced it. I mean, so we'll take your drive right. You've lost your drive, obviously, it doesn't matter. Yeah. But it's more now about. If, if I'm 300 yards down there, it's all on the line. What is in play, though, is that pull, there's, that there's, bunker with the pull. There's three bunkers there. <laughs> I think with a really solid eight iron, I'm flying them, but. Yeah, mm. you've hit it solid today all day. I mean, my eight iron is just mega. It's just your club, isn't it? Yeah. I'm, just, I'm gonna kind of draw this one a touch, try and get a bit more distance and flight. Miles over. Good shot. Miles over. Lovely shot, Pete. Anyone one more of those? Hold, anyone else holding the breath there? <laughs> yeah, I was thinking, where's that going? <laughs> Where are you going to go in with? What did you say the flag, flag was, sorry? 215. I've got a six iron still, and the, flat, the front of the green, I've got it at 190. So it's water front. Water um, front, yeah. Obviously, there's a bunker long, but if you're going to miss, miss long. Well, miss left and long, isn't it? Even that green side bunker's all right. I, I think, think you'll be, think be able to hear green regulation from there. Huh? You'll be able to take green regulation from there. Well, if, unless I, re I need to erase the last green side bunker though, but <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm obviously going to be going for it. So, but it's not an amazing lie. It's okay. Oh no. No, no. Yeah, it was, it was actually a much worse lie than I thought. No, Andy, what are you doing? <laughs> it was a much worse lie than I thought, actually. It really got snagged up on me. Closed it massively. Yeah, that's not ideal. Oh, that was a horrendous lie. It looked okay. This this video has literally had everything. <laughs> this literally. is just chaos. Absolute carnage. <laughs> 90 yards. Now, Better first things iron, fair play. First things first. That's two big eight irons. You've hit them. You've hit two eight irons for 20. I think this must have kicked off. Oh yeah, you definitely. Back of that slope. Definitely a bit of a help. Yeah. yeah. Two eight irons for 20. Yes. If I miss the green, I win. I'm out. So I'm 90 yards. I've got my 58 degree. But also, are we level as well? So if you hit the green, make par, and I two put, you actually win. Well, how are you winning this? I'm not thinking of that, Andy. What I'm thinking of is a birdie because I'm using your positive mental approach from before. Oh, well, I'm glad someone's got some of that left. <laughs> oh, 
Oh. That was looking like it was going in. It was, Dan. Little she never left a flag. <laughs> <laughs> I don't hit many of them. That's a good shot. You know what? I'm, I, I want to thank you for that, Andy, because I was literally thinking, just be more Andy. Be more positive. Be more positive. Consequences, deal with them after. Exactly. There you go. That's all you've got to do, folks. Good consequences, man. deal with them later. You're a good man. I've been dealing with consequences for the last three holes. So Carter has found it. his ball. I told you. You were trying, you were trying to make Absolute disgrace. You were trying to make me believe it was in the gorse bushes the other side. I was like, no, it definitely cleared those ones. To be honest, you're trying to make me one. believe you found it as well. All I, of a sudden, I just drove the buggy around, all of a sudden, oh, I've got it. I was with one of your employees. I've so, got I mean, it. You could, you could take it up with him in a disciplinary. I didn't realise you were playing a yellow Volvic. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, I have less of that now. Come on. So, it's 58 out of the office, not an easy shot. It's a brutal little shot, to be honest. I'm going to try and land it. Actually, where my putter is, in line with that, off the back of my stance, shoot forward, up the slope, left, right to left. Oh, a bit of a land it short, run it on. Yeah. Right, now I'm going to go in high. I'm going to land it on the very front edge. There's loads of room after the pin, yeah. so. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Uh oh. Go. It's in the bunker. Oh, mate. <laughs> no. Oh. No. Oh, my God. No, wait till you see where this is finished. Oh, God, where is it now? I've not got a stance. <laughs> <laughs> Just <laughs> caught a glimpse. That is brilliant. I've just not hit that hard enough. That's the right line. Um, do you want the bad news, by the way? What? That's you. So you've kept your you've kept your six iron. Oh, I've just lost my long. You just lost your fifty-eight. Which I need for now. <laughs> what a game! <laughs> oh, this is the best game ever. Bye, fifty-eight. See ya. So he's got to get. How has this ended up like this? <laughs> it's brilliant, isn't it? The downfall and the disaster. Right uh, up, right to left, left to right. A little snake of this. What a lovely little shot that is. Go, 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 go. Well played. Nice shot. Really good. So, after all of this, after everything which has happened, I've got to put for the win. You've got to put for the win. What I'm probably really pleased about is that we've both managed to make it to the end. We've just about made it to the end, haven't we? We definitely wouldn't have made 10 holes. No. Well, we've, yeah. I mean, that is the maximum clubs lost. Both at two over? Um, yes, yeah, both two are two over. This to get back to one over I mean, and I to was win. Four, I, I was two under three holes ago. <laughs> Life comes at you quick. <laughs> right, Finch, this to win the vlog. Right. I'm, not sure, I'm, I'm not sure how I would cope, to be honest, if this goes in. Mentally scarred. Emotionally, it would feel like it'd be quite a blow. It would be a bit of a blow. and it's a, I've got to be honest, it's quite an easy put. It's just right edge up the hill. <laughs> Tim! Eight iron, eight iron to set up the approach with a 58 and a famous victory here at Dundonald Links. Guys, I just want to say a massive thank you for watching. Huge thank you for Dundonald for hosting us for the most brutal match in YouTube history. It is as simple as that. Andy, I just want to say unlucky, basically. I don't know what's <laughs> happened. Right, I just want to say unlucky. Um, if you haven't already, hop over to Guy's channel. Some really, really good stuff. Let us know what you think about this match. Mate, I'm, I I'm, don't know where to begin. I am delighted. I also feel quite bad in many respects, but I'm sure that will wear off. We've got like 40 minutes of the car together now. We've got, me four, we've got a 40 minute drive to Turnbury where I need to try and get over this emotionally, mentally, and somehow plot my revenge. If, oh my God, I'm wounded. That's it, wounded me. If it makes you feel any better, I won't mention it. I won't talk about it ever again. I'll, I'll, I'll let it go. Line. Everyone that knows Finch knows that's not going to be half the case. 